We're here tonight for an annual gala dinner, uh, which has become the largest single fundraiser for uh, Canadian HIV and AIDS research. So it's an incredibly important evening because it's, a, it's an opportunity to both celebrate all that we've accomplished, but also recognize that there's still a gap to close and uh, we need the research to do just that. We at CANFAR have partnered with the Canadian Institutes of Health Research and the International AIDS Society to fund what we're calling cure studies. So the first time, uh, this is one of the first times we've actually thought in terms of the possibility of a cure, of getting rid of the virus in someone who's infected. It really brings the community together. All these stores contribute, and we, it's a very intimate evening. There's only three tables here tonight, Hold Room Crew. Um, my dear friend Sylvia Mantella is one of the co chairs this evening. I'm here to support her at this great event. But you know what? It's a really great feel good event to bring the city together. It brings out the Christmas spirit. But it was an incredible experience. My journey the last year was wonderful, but logistically it was challenging. But the CANFAR team is amazing and they're so supportive and I could never have done this without them um, but they've mastered it on their 19th year they've got it down pat. CANFAR was established way back in 1987 just when uh, AIDS was becoming a, a huge health concern and it was really it was started by a group of friends who wanted to do something they saw what was happening all around them uh, they saw friends who were becoming very very ill and dying and so they established this, this research foundation uh, to, to, uh, to fund medical research into all aspects of HIV and AIDS. We have 50 to 60 new babies every year at SickKids born to HIV infected mothers who are on effective treatment and those babies are uninfected. A big success story.